Hello, hey hi everyone. Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, everybody. Welcome back to the next session of SAP Aware on Hanan Training Series. Thank you for choosing the K tutorials. So, in the last couple of session, we have discussed about some like inline declaration, new syntax, uh, and in the last session we have discussed about the shoot on Hana and Aware on Hana versus shoot on Hana versus Aware on Hana. We have seen what is ECC. So, ECC is the it's a solution and it stands for uh, enterprise for components. Okay, so we have seen like this here, ABAP on HANA. Like here, what happened is this is our shoot on HANA where data only just a database for change. So we have seen the difference between shoot on HANA versus ABAP on HANA. So shoot on HANA means the entire business solution is running on top of HANA technology. And shoot on HANA is a product and ABAP on HANA is a technology. So, in the continuation of the last lecture, we will see from here, okay? So, till here, everything is clear, I hope, guys. Okay, so, this is our theta architecture. Uh, this is before, and here, database can be anything like Oracle, database, MX, TV, IBM, DB, any database. But after that, SAP HCN is completely to the HANA database, which is in-memory database, high-performance database, ever, okay? Which can store the data uh, in column store, okay? Is this clear? So this shoot on HANA uh, comes with the solution of ECC, CRM, PLM, HCM, and this SRM. Okay, here an ABAP system running on HANA database, where HANA database is the primary database. Okay, so with HANA database, we can do much faster parallel processing and we keep all the data in the RAM. So we need to reduce also the memory footprint to store the data. Also, we don't need secondary indexes. Here, in new, uh, need few indexes or I would say primary indexes. So, a lot of benefits comes, okay. Hence, a result of that, that's important to not just replace your database. Here, what we have done is we have not touched anything. We have just replaced our database, but also simply, simply or simplify our tables database tables, data models, and that that's where, again, the technology remains at that point, HANA. But behind the scene here, next time, what we are going to do, okay, so let me get this again, give me a moment. So, okay, so what happened in this HANA database, there was a major evolution which has happened. SAP had a major number of number of changes in the HANA, in the, in the HANA database, in the data model, where in the data model, to make it simplified suit, okay? To make it simplified. So basically, they change it to the data models, okay? So again, it got changed from Okay, so this is my again a theta architecture. Okay, guys. So what they have done the they have changed the data models. Okay. They have changed the data model. Okay. They change the database. So this is the first bigger difference. The change, they change the data models, and in this change the data model, they have introduced here. What they have done is they have introduced new tables. Okay. They have removed some tables, they have changed the way data is stored in the database. Okay. So what they have actually done a simplification of data as compared to business suite, it's a simplified version and that's called S, okay? That's called S, which is stands for simplification. Is this clear, guys? So what they've done, the new change is, they, uh, here, look, here, what they've done is, they have just replaced the database in the suit on HANA. But here, what they've done is, they have changed the tables, they have changed the data models, and they have came up with the new tables. Okay, so they have done, they have actually done a simplification of data data as compared to business suite, and it's a simplified version. Okay, right. 
and that is they have introduced a uh, new tables clear guys uh, we can write here new tables and what also they have done is they have removed some tables okay guys so they they have also done an improvement in terms of generation of this classical suite and that's why it's called as this one is called on as a fourth generation suite okay again they have moved from here to there and this was called known as fourth generation suite okay and that's where it begins as for hana so what this will becomes as for hana so if i will it there is as for hana also we have seen here in this slide you don't hana okay right so what they have, uh, that's where what this one has become is this one has become with as for hana now that is again a solution which sap is selling for which come our sap is selling our sap is selling s4 hana solution for which oh, for and your company is buying and companies are paying for what solution s4 hana solution okay guys now uh, think like which technology is used to build this which technology is used to build this which technology is used to build this solution yeah so exactly that is same as abap on hana which means is this clear matter that whether you work on suit on hana whether you work on hair suit on hana let me highlight this okay okay whether you work on suit on hana or whether you work on s4 hana once again Okay, guys. So this one is white for generation suit, and what the solution is S for Hana solution. Okay, it is clear, guys. So this is my suit on Hana, and this one is my S for Hana. So I will, so I will tell you the difference. So that look uh, on which technology this suit on Hana has become. This one is on ABAP on Hana, and here this also our suit S for Hana has the same technology exactly, which is ABAP on Hana. Okay, matter you work on suit on Hana or you work on S for Hana, the architecture and the technology they both are ABAP on Hana. Is this clear, guys? So technology will be the same. Whether it will be a suit on Hana or it will be a S for Hana, okay. So does that answer all of your question? Uh, what you were you was thinking like what is ABAP on Hana, what is suit on Hana, and what is S for Hana? So is it not, uh, is that clear? Clear guys, for you your company will not pay for a weapon Hana. Your company will pay for a solution. Either they buy suit on Hana, either they buy S for Hana. Okay, is clear, guys. So now with that, let me also tell you one important news, like which is that uh, by 2025, this is the deadline. The business should support is ending, which means SAP hold told that by 2025. Okay, in layman terms, if I will tell you, I would say please move to S4 Hana. Please move to guys S4 Hana by 2025. After that, we are ending the support for the business suit. Okay, so what SAP came up with? They told me, "Boy, please move to the S4 Hana after 2024. We will not give any support." Okay, so they have given this. The deadline is 2025. Okay, so uh, they say that we will no more. Support your business should please move everything, all your investments, all your custom programs, reports, includes function modules, everything to S4 architecture. So with the simplified data models provided by SAP 2025, this is deadline is provided by SAP by 2025 is a deadline, and I will give you a quick blog. Okay, for this, uh, give me a moment. Uh, 
ஸ்டோர் So this is the time when your company must have to move to the S4. There is no choice. The company have to do, go one day to S4. Okay. And this course, I will show you some good techniques uh, which you will utilize in your project in your coming years and days to actually help your company to plan this. Okay, guys. So, so the real game is start after the movement is done. as an abapon hana developer so now you are abapon hana developer so there is a lot you can achieve from this course also okay so now we will talk about s4 hana a little bit more in a detail okay s4 hana but now the main question comes into the picture let me again repeat quickly what we have just discussed till here okay here we have seen uh, ecc suit on hana versus web on hana okay so basically we started our first we have started from three tier architecture we saw the ecc ecc was the solution which companies used to buy the technology in which ecc is coded was about like microsoft operating system which you buy the technology in which microsoft is coded in c programming similarly here ecc is a solution abap pizza and abap pizza technology okay then came up with the hana so sap replaced any database whichever the database was there they completely replaced with the hana database simply running replacing the database with hana database and it becomes the cotone hana as a solution which companies started buying there was uh, there was paying for this solution now that is called as a technologically it's an app on hana technology but they didn't show major performance improvement as such that what they do they so they put or changing the data model look as what i just told you ki bhai after that they have completely changed the database this hana database is their primary database now and what this they call is as a cotone hana okay but after changing the database also their performance was not increasing okay so but after that what they thought they they thought of changing their data model okay so they have simplified the database tables data models in hana and they have done a lot of research and after they have obtained the simplification of data okay simplification of data models they your then your table structure which i will show you again after some time okay so this is what sap have and that has become s4 hana simplified for generation sure and that's another solution so there are two solution which may process cost yes today in the market one is s4 hana and another is sap suton hana in your company okay you can either be on this or you can already on this it depends on companies to companies some companies already on uh, already moved their business to s4 hana but some of them are think again planning to move to s4 hana solution okay so for hana will remain as a business suit as a erp solution in the market and for that technology is abapon hana which is relevant for us okay so yes suton hana will also go away basically the whole business of suit support is ending in 2025 so this was uh, business suit actually so this is all ending by this business suit is all ending by 2025 so it will also go away on the stack which remains is s4 okay and technology wise it's a abapon hana which remains in the market okay and we will also see the evolution of s4 hana how it comes when it was released what are the other benefits of s4 
but some of you already in i think training phase also is it clear guys okay so by looking at the design by looking at the overall architecture understood the difference okay understood the overall perspective what is my duty as a consultant as a technical consultant what do they expect from me when they are moving from uh, shu to hana to s4 hana what they can what our company can expect from me okay suppose i will call these three different destinations okay this will be as well. okay i will call this first point as a x okay uh, give me one second I will call this as a call this as a P and this right C. Okay, so it call it as point B and then finally our point C. Okay, clear guys. Right? now what type of questions your company or your manager can ask you when they are moving from here a to b or b to c okay or a or directly a to c okay as a as you are a at the upon hana consultant okay so for your company just replacing the database so basically they are moving from a to b so basically your company just change the different uh, this database they are not touching they are not touching anything okay there is no change okay they are just changing the database to hana database which means they are moving from point a to point b okay guys exactly they are going from point a to p point b they are just replacing the database from point a to point b so this is one possibility the first question comes in your company is my is let like my custom code is still affected okay so whatever we have done here will it still be there also so all those things we will discuss in the next session so for this uh okay guys so uh, we will see in the next session like uh, whenever you are moving from one database to another database from point a to b like uh, whatever we have done the here will all the custom code will be valid or not all of this questions we will see okay and that's all for this session thank you so much bye bye